right here in beautiful downtown Reedsville. And we are having a ball. The weather finally is cooperating. It's beautiful. And the town is full of people and cars. So with me right now is John Butler. And John teaches at McMichael High School over in Mayadan. And he and a group of his kids are doing electric cars. So tell, tell me a little bit about that. Well, we started a uh, great project, Debbie, in um, 2009, doing our first electric conversion. And we called it the prototype. And Last year we did a second uh, vehicle, a lot nicer body and a lot of upgraded features to the car and we wanted to bring it out to the community, to Reesville and, and to Eden and some of the other places, Madison, Mayadan and show it off and that's why we brought it here to the Reesville Easy Street Cruise Inn. It's been a great show. Yeah, it has been and I know the guys are trying to work their way around to bring it up here for us to actually see the car. Are you one of the students? Yeah. All right, what's your name? Tyler Haney. And tell us what part you've played in this. Um, I did a lot of the body work, like the buffing and waxing mm -hmm. on the car, and then I designed stuff like this sign. Oh, so you're a graphics guy? Yeah. Well, cool. Tell us about your sign here. Um, this is just a sign with all of our sponsorships and on it on it that we had last year. Okay. You want to tell it, read them off just in case they can't see it? Yeah. Uh, some of our big sponsors here were uh, Mayflower, uh, not the one in Riesel, right. you know how that goes, <laughs> but the one over in uh, Madison, Always and Forever Florence. Those are some of our biggest, and Interstate Batteries and Signs and Trophies in Madison, that's some of our biggest. And right behind you, we got our car. Okay, come on boys, bring it on up here. There we go. Yay! All right, there we go. All right, let's stop it right there. Want to come on out and talk to me? All right, first tell the folks who you are. I'm Hunter Folks. And Hunter, what part did you play in this? Uh, I was the lead mechanic on the project. So you're interested in being a mechanic when you grow up? Yes, ma'am. And you like the idea of doing electric cars? Mm -hmm. All right, is this totally electric or is it a, uh, or is it a hybrid of some sort? Um, it's fully electric. Fully electric? Yes, ma'am. How far can you go? Uh, we get 35 miles on a charge. That's pretty good. Especially if you live in a town or something like that. Yeah. Uh, but it costs $2 in electricity bill to charge this fully as it does $2 for gasoline and you won't go near as far. Well, this is true. You know, $2 worth of um, gas might get you around the corner. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> what kind of car is this? It's a uh, 1992 Mustang uh, Coupe. So... You guys converted a 92 Mustang Coupe into an electric car. Yes, ma'am. Well, that's pretty awesome. Well, tell us who you are. Uh, Quentin Dickerson. And what was your part in this? I was a mechanic with Hunter folks over here. Okay. So what was your favorite part of this? Um, just learning about how electricity works and new technology about electric cars. That was that's pretty awesome. I think you guys have done an absolutely phenomenal job, and I see you've got a lot of... Uh, Rolling out electric fox. Is that what you're calling this? The electric fox. I think that's absolutely phenomenal. I like that. Thank you. All right. What's your next project? Well, what we want to do, that's called, I don't know if Hunter said, we want to move up our battery technology, change it to lithium power, get some bigger range, and change the motor. You know, just like all the guys out here want bigger motor, more power. Yeah. <laughs> and the one thing I want to do is give a plug to our website okay. at uh, lab306.com. Lab, lab306.com. You got it. That's the uh, name of our classroom, <laughs> Lab 306. It seemed like a great name. And if somebody wanted to learn about the car and how we built it and how the students did a lot of work on it, that we got tons of pictures and blog and everything to keep up with us. And, and if they want to maybe become a sponsor, somebody listening on the program wants to sponsor us, we're looking for it. So That's right, folks. These guys need money to continue this project. And I think it is an absolutely fabulous project. They're learning something wonderful, and they will be carrying this forward in the future. So congratulations, guys. And come on, give them some money. <laughs> that would help out. That would help out. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Hope you'll be with us again next year with a bigger and better lithium battery. There you go. Thanks, you, Debbie. <laughs> All right, thanks. I'm going to let you pull it out of here. All right. <laughs> As we... All right, we've got the Buffalo Beach coming up here. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, that's good. All right, I like this. This is uh, this is pretty awesome. Tell us who you are and where you're from. Um, Tommy Heffinger, I'm from Stone.